This final stretch of the midterms, new polling from ABC News shows voters are very concerned about the risk of politically motivated violence. ABC's Justin Finch in Washington with the details. In a closing case to voters in California and New Mexico, President Biden declaring democracy is on the midterm ballot. There's too much political violence. There's too much intimidation. That risk of politically motivated violence is top of mind for many Americans, according to new polling from ABC News and The Washington Post. That polling finds 88% of adults are concerned that the nation is at an increased risk of political violence, with political divisions so starkly split. The poll comes one week after a man allegedly looking for House Speaker Nancy Pelosi broke into her California home and brutally bludgeoned her husband with a hammer. New York Governor Kathy Hochul telling CNN she's concerned about the spread of radical ideas. Every single elected official needs to call this out and condemn this violence. The nation's poll workers are already facing threats as well. Philadelphia's district attorney warning of consequences. Extremists of any type who are pondering, interfering in any way with a free, fair, and final election better be warned. We have handcuffs, we have jail cells, and we have Philadelphia juries that will be here. And going into the final weekend of the campaign that could decide which party controls the Senate, three presidents will stump in Pennsylvania, Obama, Biden, and Trump. And this Tuesday, you must vote Republican in a giant red wave. This is a choice, a choice between two vastly different visions of America. And back to that poll, women are more likely than men to be concerned about the risk of politically motivated violence. Over two-thirds of women saying they're very concerned. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.